Hey everyone, welcome back to our Brazil game. So, we are at an interesting point in the game. We're barely defending culture victory. We are on the verge of losing. And we need to attack. We basically need to attack Japan somehow. So, um, let's see. We're getting some aerodromes. Next turn, we'll have two aerodromes. We need to make planes. We do have the Congress for building units. So that's going to help us. Half cost production. And we'll see what we can do. Hopefully we can prevent this. Should be should be interesting. Whatever happens. So we're not going to renew our friendship with Japan. Okay, we have to reject this. Have to reject the friendship. We stole some more gold. Very nice. Okay, let's go ahead and play a card. Let's put in Strategic Air Force. 50% production toward air units. That looks good. Okay, and now we build bombers. Let's build a bomber here as well. Let's take a look at the culture victory, 122 out of 174. It was, was kind of slowed it down. Well, hopefully that continues. And let's go ahead and buy a bomber as well. Let's get a few of these. Buy one there. I want to get a few bombers for sure. And let's get some cuirassiers. We're going to need some tanks. Okay, we have to escape, stole some gold, successful, beautiful. And we can promote our spy here. Let's just do quartermaster, I guess. Okay, actually in Rio here, we need to get probably, let's see here, what makes the most sense? War department, maybe? I think maybe war department. It's gonna slow down our science victory, but if we don't really have anybody else to worry about other than Japan, Right? I think, let's see, tech-wise, we're five techs ahead. We just need to take Japan out and, and we can win, I think. So yeah, let's get War Department here. That's what we should do. And let's send a spy to Japan, a city toward the, the back of their empire so that we can maintain the mission throughout, throughout our conquest. I think we'll plan to attack in two turns. You know what? Let's get computers real quick. Um, this is going to give us the drone. We can get a drone and then we'll be able to actually hit the cities with our planes. Okay, we are sort of defending culture victory. It looks like we're defending it pretty well. So that's good. And for our next government, uh, I was about to get optimization imperative, but I think distributed sovereignty is going to be a little better, a little more culture. But we don't want to get into it yet. Actually, let's see. Maybe we need to get into fascism. Maybe that's what I need. That's probably what I should do. All right, let's get tanks. Buy a cursier. And let's get one more bomber, I think. Let's get a drone. Two drones. Let's get two drones. Do another spy mission for gold. Ooh, actually here, let's do the oil plant. That's a boost for advanced ballistics. And we need to get, uh, we need, we're losing coal. So that's important to maintain. Japan does not have steel yet. It's interesting. So they have uranium. Wow. Uranium, but no steel. They have oil and uranium, but no steel yet. But they will have steel very soon. All right, let's get into fascism. Plus five combat strength. And it's going to sort of hurt our our culture a bit. But that's okay. Put Whistlebunk in there. Democratic Legacy there. Let's actually put in market economy instead of five-year plan. Third alternative. We need to probably get out. We have our, our quite a few bombers. That's good. Let's do lightning warfare for cavalry units. Let's do force modernization. We need to upgrade to tanks and stuff. We might as well do drill manuals, maybe. Okay, I think we can declare. Let's see. We can denounce, I believe. Denounce. Japan, and then do a Golden Age War. Beautiful. Yep, and this should do quite a bit of damage here. Oh my, look at that. 120 strength. Okay, pretty nice. Our Golden Age is really helping here, so... Well, Heroic Age, I should say, but... Two arms plus ten against cities. I feel like I should just run in there and take the city. Yeah, let's hit there. Let's just run in with this guy, take that, beautiful. And I think we can keep that. Good stuff. Let's combine these units here. Did we get any great works? 
Yes, we did. Beautiful. We got some, got a couple of ratings, a couple of works of art. So that's good. Transfer that culture over to us. We have no way of getting an oil well. Our oil is under this theater square, so we'll just push through that without boosting it. Let's see, what are we pushing toward? I guess, I guess helicopters, maybe. Do some more upgrades, artillery. Get some, oh yeah, mechanized infantry. Sounds good. And if we get this city, let's see, is this in... Yeah, if we get Nagoya, we get Estadio, which is a big boost to culture. Should be able to defend after that. Get some more tanks. Let's go ahead and promote Liang here as zoning commissioner. Plus some production on cities revealed resources. Makes our farm pretty nice there. And let's go ahead and buy another drone here. So we can target this city up here. Ooh, unit captured. <laughs> His samurai army captured my one charge builder. Okay, how is culture victory coming? He is moving up still pretty quickly. We game's definitely not over yet. Let's uh let's definitely hit this city. Let's hit it again there. And we can take it. Let's do it. Go, go, yes. Awesome, we get a stadio. That's huge. Okay, it's gonna rebel in nine turns. Maybe we need to move a governor there. No, actually, no, we're good. I think we're fine. Ooh, we have more coal over here, beautiful. Get our drone up to the front. Now we can see these cities. And let's just move this over to Nagoya, yeah. Okay, and now we need to start building our spaceport here. We'll have to crush our um, city park, that's fine. Four turns on the spaceport, not bad. Okay, let's do listening posts. That gives us an extra plus three combat strength against Japan. He still has intel on us, that's interesting. Oh, we need to get this merchant. Yikes. Okay, we got a project. That's another level of diplomatic visibility that'll help with the war. Let's project for that. Let's see. Do commercial hub project. And let's do another one here. And let's do another one there, too. These three. That should do the job, I think. Special session. Betrayal emergency. Uh-oh. And a military emergency. Yikes. Okay. Hopefully our ally doesn't turn on us here. Maybe they can't. I forget what the rules are. We'll have to see. Oh, no. Everybody turned on us. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Okay. Well, now this will be a challenge. We don't have a trading partner. Okay, let's see. Wow, everybody got in on that, huh? Whoa, both of them too, okay. Well, let's try to take out Japan as quickly as we can here. Okay, hit there, hit there, take this, beautiful. Okay, where to send our trade routes now? That really hurt our production, wow. Maybe we need to do Magnus internal routes? Where is Magnus even located? Out here, I guess that works. Plus two production. Do a route to there, got a five, six route. Basically every city can sort of just send a route there. Keep the city. And now we can, we have the drone up here. We can start hitting this city. There, there. We need a land, we need a unit to take that though. Oh, I think we can. Yeah, let's take that. Beautiful. Wow, we're sweeping through. We're lucky he doesn't have steel yet. Okay, this is a little scary because there is the Congress toward making units too. So the AI is gonna have that and we're at war with literally everybody. We, we're gonna have to make units. Okay, let's check culture victory. Still doing well, still doing fine. We'll just send all these routes to cities with the most production. Oh, we got a double promoted spy. This is good. Beautiful. And we just got a policy card. How did, oh, how did we get that? Oh, Forbidden City. Good. Let's do five year plan. That looks good. We don't need too much science. We're probably gonna fall to two turning stuff soon, but it's okay. Unit captured by Phoenicia. Oh boy, okay. We unlocked our tier four government, but let's wait on that. Stole 2000 gold. We're waiting on our tier four government because, because there's no government that gives you extra combat strength like the way fascism does. 
So we'll just stick to this for now. Let's hit the capital. Hit the capital. And we can even hit three tiles back with the drone. And let's take it. Beautiful. Yes. Still no steel on him, which is surprising. Wow. Okay, we need units. We need to build units. And we just, we should have, yeah, we got the Diplo Visibility. That's good. It's like plus three combat, universal. Oh, they're coming from everywhere. Wow. We're going to, this is going to be tough. It's going to be interesting. <laughs> Even over here. Wow. Let's just position units, try to block, make more units. Oh, we, we got machine guns. We need to promote, promote a machine gun. Okay, let's get another machine gun here. Double promoted spy. I think we can send to Venetia, maybe. Okay, tanks pretty much everywhere. We could probably buy some machine guns. They are kind of expensive, but probably worth it. Oh shoot, I'm out of oil. Oh no. Oh boy, okay, let's see. So we should do something else. I guess we'll do infantry, maybe? We'll just do AT crew. That works. AT crew and machine guns. Maybe some fighters actually too. Yeah, let's take out force modernization and let's put in strategic air force. Yeah, and we can probably take out whistle bunk and we're not getting much from that. And do maybe collective activism just to guarantee that we defend culture victory. Democratic legacy isn't even doing much for us either. I think e-commerce makes sense, a little more production. We could also do this one, 100, 116 science. Oh, market economy doesn't make any sense either. Yeah, we should do, we'll do e-commerce there and then International Space Station agency there. And then let's get some, yeah, we'll get some fighters. Let's try to kill this cavalry. Beautiful. Let's move this bomber. Hmm. Probably right here. Another promotion on this guy, that's good. Take Disrupt Rocketry. Ooh, we got tanks coming in now. Yeah, definitely glad we took War Department. Definitely. <laughs> With all this. Alright, let's hit this city. Right there. Hit there. And let's take it. Beautiful. And on to the next one here. Ooh, that did some damage. Okay, we need more oil. We're running low on oil. Yikes. Um, we'll do... Let's do this card. It looks like our coal is back in balance. I think we're getting three... Plus three oil from this. Which doesn't quite balance us out, but... Getting closer. Alright, let's hit here. Take this out. Hit here. Hit there. Hit there. I'm gonna... Oh, there's some oil out here. Yeah, let's get this get this oil improved. That might actually bring us back into balance. We do need to get another spaceport. Let's go ahead and start building that. Okay, double promoted spy. Let's transfer to probably Grand Columbia. Yeah, let's transfer down here for a spy mission. For a listening post mission for extra combat strength. Okay, 10 turns in the era. We've finished a fighter here. Let's hit there. Finish that. Hit there. Finish that. We can take this guy out. Beautiful. Combine these two. Combine, the, combine these three. And combine these three. Okay, let's keep working on these other cities. Maybe up to this one. Still no steel walls, that's surprising. Hit there, take that out, take that out, almost. We are out of oil though. We need to get more oil. Hopefully this makes us positive. Take this unit out, beautiful. Okay, space, um, our first spaceport is done. Let's do Satellite, so we have War Department. We can't line up the builders and use the charges like we normally would, but that's okay. We still have an eight tech lead. Let's get a nuclear, let's see, nuclear plant. We have plus seven per turn. I think we can afford that. Although this spot isn't the best. We should probably do that 
in a more centralized spot. Actually, we should do that where we have our oil plant. Right here. Next turn, yeah, we can switch to nuclear power. Leave the oil for the units. Oh, Buenos. We just met Buenos. Nobody is Sus? Wait. Darwiga has two envoys in there. We should definitely grab that. I mean, I guess our amenities are pretty much maxed out, so it's not going to help. It gives bonus resources behave like luxuries, providing amenities. But still, extra production on our power plants. Okay, let's take this city out. Only three left for Japan. And our oil is at zero. So I should... I need to, like, delete a unit or something. Maybe this one's taking up oil. Let's just delete this. Let's delete that. Oh, a lot of units down here. Okay. Okay, this is where we need help. Kill this. Good. Hit that. Almost kill that. Okay, our spy is here. We can do listening posts. This gives us plus six combat because it's double promoted. We should take out the... Lightning warfare. We're not making. We're not really able to make more cavalry. We can do military first to make more machine guns faster. That looks good. Okay, let's see what happens down here. This will be interesting. Okay, we launched our satellite. Beautiful. We just got nanotechnology. Five more techs till laser projects. Somewhere we need to find smart materials in there too. Okay, we're positive oil now. That's good. Let's see, I think we can kill this here. Yeah, perfect. And then move this up. Take the city. Beautiful. Keep that. Just two more left for Japan. Hit this city. Okay, rainforest scientists. This is pretty nice. I think we lose our overflow though when we do this. But we have lots of rainforest. Here's four rainforest. Um... I think about four reinforced is going to be the best we can do. But let's wait until we can't one turn something. Because whenever you use one of those, you, uh, it removes overflow. And we're, we probably have quite a bit of overflow right now. Okay, let's launch our moon landing. Three turns. Okay, I think we can handle this. Beautiful. Take that unit out. Hit that. Let's put a spy into our main spaceport city. We don't want to have that disabled. Let's get a spaceport down here. Oh, that's right where the guy's standing. Okay, never mind. <laughs> okay, we finally have a spy here in Grand Columbia. That'll help. So now we have plus six intel. Oh, we have a Nikola Tesla. Extends the reach of our regional industrial zone buildings. Let's do the nuclear plant right here. That should spread more science and production to more cities. Beautiful. Six turns on a spaceport here. Let's do it. It might be a little late. It might be a couple turns late, but it'll probably still help. Okay, let's counter spy the spaceport here. Ooh, we have jet fighters. Let's go ahead and promote. Ooh, okay. Let's take this guy out. Beautiful. We also heal up a little bit. And we got a promotion. Nice. Let's buy a stock exchange here. We should have done that before. That boosts our gold a lot. Okay, let's shoot this unit. Yeah, and then we can finally take the city. Yes. There we go. One more city of Japan's. You know what? Let's get a spaceport here, too. It might finish too late, but maybe it, maybe it won't. Wow, even Kree. Kree is sending units. <laughs> Alright, there's our moon landing. Beautiful. And one more city to take. All right, here we go. See if we can get in one more shot on the city. Yes. And let's take it. Oh, we did it. Yes, no more Japan. Okay, now we just have to win. Have to defend the attacks and win. Let's see if we'll... Can they make peace with us? This is one thing I'm okay scamming. No, I don't, they're not even going to do it. That's fine. All right, Japan is gone. Yeah, let's just put units on the border, defend. Okay, we have, we've used up our overflow to the point where we can't one turn stuff anymore. So let's use our scientists now. Okay, now that makes it one turn, that's good. 
And I think we, we have an overload of culture. Let's take this out. This isn't really even doing much for us. We we really just need more science to get through these last techs as fast as we can. And really, we need more production, actually. that's We're, we're kind of slow on our projects, our space projects. Um, we need production in the space cities, specifically. Oh, we should put in... Let's put in integrated space cell. Extra 15% production. We're going to have to buy a military academy in our main space city. I mean, it looks like this is... We're doing basically the best we can in terms of production. So let's put in rationalism. I think we can now take... We can, we can get out of fascism now. And go into... Let's see here. Probably, probably synthetic technocracy is what we really need. Let's do that, actually. So you can change your policies, set them, and then change into a government. I mean, so it was basically pointless, the policy change that I did. But sometimes you can do it so that you, you get some kind of a benefit out of it. I mean, I guess colonial taxes boosts our, our newer cities a little bit. Democratic legacy. We do have trade-offs to city-states. Some of them, I don't know, Whistlebanken, same thing. Just a little bit of production. I mean, maybe we just play that because I there's I don't know what else to really do. I guess gold is actually more valuable. Raj gives a little science, I guess. That looks all right. Okay, that should get us two turns on that. But we still have to launch a couple more projects. Let's see, Mars Colony, two turns. Pretty good production here, considering that we don't have any ally to trade with, I guess. Might as well hit these cities, I guess. Maybe start taking some of these. How many techs ahead? We're still eight ahead. That's good. Now, we need to find smart materials. Let's see. It must be... We'll finish this, and then I think we can... It must be this one. Interesting. So, yeah, we do have a few turns. Okay. Let's actually filter. So, food. Not that. Improvements, highlights these two, not that one. And production, highlights that, these, okay, these two. So it, it, ha it has to be this one. Let's switch to that, go straight to that. So we actually aren't late with our projects here, aren't late for smart materials will be on track. We got a spaceport here, very good. Ooh, governor neutralized, interesting. Not a big deal though. Guess we might as well start hitting these cities. Ooh, enemy siphoning gold in Rio. Ooh, we got, a, got some units over here. Okay, we'll have to come over to defend that. There's Mars Colony. So next we can, I guess, shift enter into smart materials. Shift entering carries over a turn of production, limited to only one turn. So yeah, we're gonna shift enter this city's production. Oh, and we should actually buy now by our military academy. So we get that extra 15% production with the integrated space cell card. About 300 production there. And a note about this government. So this government gives us an extra 30% production towards city projects. That's the nice thing about this one. This is kind of the main uh, space tier 4 government, I would say. Oh, we've got a spaceport right here. We can probably pillage. Oops, I didn't shift enter. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, we should have shift entered that, but not a big deal. It'll still have quite a bit of carryover. About 217 carried over. Excess. Okay, now we have two more techs till off-world mission. The laser projects. Two turns on exoplanet expedition, that works. Okay, I guess this spaceport is still under construction, yeah. So we can just sit on it, that prevents them from finishing it. Oh! Uh-oh, wait, a nuke? Am I getting nuked? What was that? Wait, where was the... Did I get nuked? No, was that one of my units defending? Or was that... What was that, a nuclear sub? Did I just get nuked? No. Weird. Sounded like a nuke. Okay, one turn, off-world mission. That's the important one. We're gonna have... Wow, we almost one turned this. That means we're carrying over like almost a full turn of production for a laser project, which is great. Does anybody have nukes? I wonder. Do they actually have nukes? They might. These three. They would have to build the Manhattan Project and build nukes. 
Maybe they've done that. Interesting. Let's buy... I should probably buy some anti-air. Or maybe buy a giant death robot. Those defend nukes nicely if they have promotions. We can put it right here, and I think it sort of protects the surrounding tiles. And we basically should shift enter in every city that has a spaceport. Two of these aren't done yet, so it's really only two cities. So we'll shift enter in this city, and then, I mean, this city has to finish this first. Maybe I'll get some anti-air to defend a mobile SAM. Let's see. Yeah, we can one turn a mobile SAM just in case. Just in case the AI gets gets aggressive with the nukes. Okay, let's shift enter the production here. Ooh, that sounds like another nuke. But maybe it's just defense. Ooh, they're they're attacking. They're doing some damage. Killed one of my units here. Okay, modern era. We have another golden age. There's our exoplanet expedition. And I think we just want heartbeat of steam. We don't really have many international routes. That looks good. Okay, we got a merchant, extra trade route capacity. That's good. Let's buy a trader right here. And let's try to, let's see, how much aluminum do we have? 55. So we can do Lagrange project. These don't require power. This city can also do a Lagrange project. Actually, let's see here. Doesn't matter. Yeah, that's fine. This city can two turn. I guess the green just fine. And let's complete future tech as many times as we can. We get an extra 5% production towards city projects, like space projects, every time we finish. Ooh, somebody recruited some partisans here. Oh my goodness, look at that. <laughs> what is that? That's crazy. Whew. Whoa, okay. Not much we can do about that. I mean, I'm... I'm we're almost done. We'll be done in a few turns, so we just gotta survive that. That city's pretty much irrelevant. Let's see, chosen operation. Let's do um, disrupt rocketry unavailable. Vote ourselves up here. We'll sort of split these two. Let's check diplomacy victory, make sure that's not happening. Seven out of 20, we're fine. But yeah, let's focus, uh, let's see, sort of split. Yeah, seven, 10, three, that looks good. Let's do that. And there's two Lagrange projects. Jodwig, I got that one. And Disrupt Rocketry unavailable. Good. Check. So we're seven techs ahead. That's good. Wow, they're really making a push here. We could defend this with our robot. Do a ranged attack there. Does our robot have the anti-air defense? That's a, that's, yeah, we do. Okay. Drone anti-air defense increased to 130. Anti-air strength 140, that's great. Move this over here. Okay, can we do another? Yes, we can. We can do one turn stuff. Terrestrial, that's fine. These are fine as long as you launch them on a rollover. And as long as they have an industrial zone powering the city. You don't really want to launch them mid-turn unless you have a lot of renewable energy. And by mid-term, I mean like chopping and stuff like that. This is wild. I've never seen anything like this. Did we get nuked by the... What? Did we get nuked? No, I don't think so. Well, it sounds like another nuke, but I don't think it is. Apparently not. I think it's just the defense that makes that sound. Did we get nuked? Because I have to repair the city center. Did I get nuked? I wonder if I did. No, but I would have... I, the city strength... Hmm. I don't know. There would have been green stuff all over, too. Okay, another spaceport city. We can do some Lagrange projects. Or terrestrial. It doesn't really matter. Because we're not launching any mid-turn with the builders. And we are going five light years per turn. Okay, a few more laser projects. Up to eight light years per turn. A couple more turns and we should be done. I think we can basically just queue up campus research. Doesn't really matter what we do in most cities. Even more even more laser projects. Let's have a look. 11 per turn. Yeah, we, let's just shift enter. That's it. That is it. That should be it. Okay, let's do it. That was harder than I thought it was gonna be. The AI almost won a culture victory there. We had to go on the attack, the full 
the full response from all the AIs that w I had to build a bunch of units. That was fun. Kind of chaotic at the end. There we go. There's the victory screen. We did it. So online speed. Let's see what turn we're rolling it to turn 119. So the main menu considers this a turn 118 win. Not particularly fast, um, but not bad, not bad, considering the chaos at the end. I'd say this is about like a turn 200-ish standard speed game. The, the reason it's not an exact 1 to 2 ratio between online and standard speed is because the movement is exactly the same on both. So on online speed, moving your settlers takes up a much bigger percentage of the game. Like maybe moving, moving four tiles takes basically twice as long from a percentage viewpoint so it it slows down online speed is a bit slower in that sense seems to be about like a three to five ratio sometimes it changes with like super fast speed runs the the ratio will be even weirder almost almost approaching a one-to-one -one ratio but yeah that's that was fun fun game I think Deity is probably going to be the, a good difficulty for me on this. I had been doing Pro. We'll see. We might get back to that. But I would lose a lot of those games too. Alright, cool. Thanks for watching everybody. Hope everybody enjoyed. And appreciate the support as always.